Good evening, how my beautiful queens and house of kings doing this evening? How you all doing? Welcome or welcome back to another day in the new video. This would be kind of like a little uh, chit chat video. Yes, yeah, so I'm back, you all. Um, yeah, this would be kind of like a little story time chit chat video. Um, you all know I just recently was telling you all about I had shared in this would be like part two. I just recently. Um, share a story time on my channel the video was uploaded three days ago and i was just basically sharing my truth my real truth that i've been you know battling with ever since i, I was 25 years old and that was me losing my hair at um at 25 and i'm currently 39 so i just want to thank you all so much i was checking my youtube analytics this morning and i want to say I, I i'm just forever grateful for you all and i truly appreciate you all um I, your sweet words of encouragement i noticed that video kind of did numbers and it really increased my um subscribe account and I really didn't expect that it would, you know, I would gain subscribers off that video. Um, I, I just was, you know, just wanted to share my story and get that video out. But I noticed when I was reading a lot of the comments, a lot of the women that, um, most, a lot of the women was telling me, you know, to keep, you know, stay strong and was giving me tips and tricks on products that, you know, what I can do and what I can use. And, uh, and, and a lot of you all, when I say, I thank you all so much for your sweet words of encouragement and it really brought tears to my eyes um because a lot of people was I, i'm learning now that i'm not alone in this journey and so um i do go back to the doctor on the 14th of may for a follow-up and i'm am going to ask my doctor because a lot of people have mentioned in the, um, on the, in the comment session to maybe maybe i need to have my iron check or you know what kind of foods that I eat and consume and I know and I have heard people I have heard someone told me that in the past maybe I need to switch my diet up a little bit so I said I mean I'm going to you know um, do that as well I do eat a lot of baked and boiled foods like I love boiled chicken baked chicken I, tr I, 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 I my biggest concern is and I know I'm gonna have to try to cut back on this is pork you know coming from a family and you you know you was eating pork all your life and so i know that's going to be my biggest pet peeve and i'm praying and trusting god with it but yeah uh, I, when i say the comments were so sweet i really nearly got teary-eyed because when i was telling my daughter i said you know i didn't even think the video would do that good you know a lot of people you know told me in the, on the a lot of the women that was commenting on my um in the comment session was like you're not alone you know they've been battling with it for some time and so one lady had mentioned um, some about try shea butter mix, and I had looked on Amazon, and it looked familiar because I had tried this product before. Because um, when I was 16 years old, I was suffering from bad acne, real bad. And my um, teacher at the time, when I was in um, 10th grade, he was from Nigeria, so he saw that I was going through. Because like I said by then, my skin was really, really bad as well. And he gave me a product and now as an adult when i say i very seldom get breakouts and stuff like that that product really work it come in like a little bottle and you can just rub it you know it, on your skin on your face or whatever so i did price me some up on amazon i mean i'm going to try a lot of the tips that was given to me but i know i can't get all the products right away but a lot of the um tips was recommended as like natural natural ingredients or natural products that you have at home and you know some stuff i do carry at home i mean i'm going to try them as well but like i say you are I, I i i'm just forever grateful i thank you all so much for just you know just listening to my story because like i say it was really hard doing that video but i'm learning that i got to get out of my comfort zone if i want to still you know if i really want to continue to you know um well which i'm still going to do this anyway if i got to get up out of my head and push the videos out because I never know who might can give me a word, you know, even though I'm, you know, showing you all my truths and documenting my life. I never know how, you know, people can really inspire me to be better and, you know, stuff like that. But, yeah, so um, I did oil my scalp. This is, I had installed this, well, the wig not installed now because it's kind of lifting up. Um, I had purchased this wig off of, um, it's a synthetic wig. I had got this off of Amazon for $21. I had purchased it like two months ago. It just been packed away in my closet. But yeah, I end up, I don't want, well, 
like up in here is bald but um a little bald right here i didn't really do like a full chop i kind of left some of the hair i kind of left a little hair in certain areas like because um i like i said i didn't have any clippers so when i was taking my hair out when i was taking my I'm sorry, when I was taking the, the little crochet style out, my hair got matted. So that's kind of what made me just say I'm just going to chop it off and be through with it and just try to let it go back. Just cut like when I was, you know, because it was on the neck. When I was taking it out, it kept getting matted because, see, I had what I had did the hairstyle when I was, um, it was for my birthday back here in March. So now it's April. So it's been in like a month and a couple weeks. So I noticed my hair kind of got like matted up in it, even though I was greasing the scalp. So I just ended up cutting what I could. When I get some razors, I might go in. I'm gonna see how it has stuff. I'm gonna see how it go with the the little hair that I did kill. But yeah, it's it's for one, my scalp is very very itchy. So I had to go in a while ago and just order with the black castor oil that i was showing you out in the video but i did say when i go to the doctor i'm gonna see what kind of shampoo that they refer me first before i actually go out and buy the product but i didn't mind buying that um product that the lady that one of the ladies referred to me about the shea butter because i was actually to be honest i was using that i was using like it, it was like in the bob like a little jar it was yellow i was actually using that back here for my face so when I looked at it on Amazon, it did say it's good for hair, skin, and nails. So I ended up purchasing that. She said she had mixed. She uses it herself. She mixed. Um, I can't think of her name. I'm, I, I apologize because there were so many people commenting on the video about, you know, their tips and tricks, what I should use for my hair. So she said she mixed that up with the castor oil. And so, I, you know, I'm just going to finish up the little black castor oil that I got right now. And then, like I say, I order more. But like I say, once I go back to the doctor, I'm gonna see what they say. Cause like I say, a lot of you, I was, a lot of you, I was telling me, encouraging me to, you know, go to the doctor and have some, you know, work done to see what could be the cause of it. But yeah, yeah, I just, I'm, I'm, I'm just, like I say, I'm trusting God on this journey. I, I'm praying for hair growth. Um, it's really hard, you know, coming out your comfort zone, selling, showing your real truths. But I feel like that's the whole purpose of me doing this and creating content is to, you know, share my real truths with the world, you know. Um, I know some things that I will continue to keep private to myself, but like certain things that I feel like somebody can relate to or maybe I can just get some inspiration from, I don't mind sharing, you know. Um, like I say, the, the... Okay, you all, I'm back. Um, I had to answer, I had a call come through, but yeah, I, um, yeah, but, um, I, I'm just forever thankful and grateful for everybody that, you know, the video reach and for your, you all sweet words of encouragement to just, you know, just look out, you know, what to, um, what products to use. Like I say, your tips and product suggestions really is, you know, really is helpful for me. And I'm going to just keep you all updated on uh, my hair journey and I'll let you know if I you know start seeing growth and yeah I just wanted to just come in and just you know just share that with you all